Morning everybody, welcome to uh, Nathan's Fishing Adventures in association with uh, North Sea Angling. Um, back down on Shaky Beach, it's the uh, 5th of the 3rd, 2021. Uh, I've been here about an hour now, uh, had one little dogfish so far. I'm on the Ray Hunt and Bass today. I've got three rods, but only two out at the moment. Um, I'll go through some of the rigs I'm using in a bit, I'll show you what I'm doing, all that sort of stuff, a few bits of baiting up and that, um, but I hope you enjoy, see you soon. Well I think on my uh, right rod there, I've had a few nice little pull downs and I'm not sure if there's a race out on it. There is a little bit of swell and I have got braid on that reel but shouldn't have pulled like it has been. A couple of them have been them poxy seagulls that you can see flying in front. But my left rod's uh, first time out with this one today. Courtesy of Mr. Saul Page. The old Any Fish Anywhere Pro Mark 2 Fixed Ball Edition. I'll say I've had quite a few casts with it of a plane. Second bit of bait out there. It's a, it's a lovely rod, gotta say that. Let's just hope we can christen it today. As you can probably hear, the wind is a bit blustery today. Does look like it's going to absolutely tip it down. Northeastly, and it's a bit chilly, to be honest. Popsy seagulls are doing me head in. That's like the sixth seagull bite I have had in the last 20 minutes. I don't know if it's me or are they just getting dumber. I swear when I was younger, these used to dodge your line. Now they just plough through it. Oh, I think I'm going to give that uh, well, see if there's anything sat on it, if not, I'll, uh, I'll put it back down. Right then, show you the rig I'm using today. Box standard, 6 ounce DCA. Gemini splash down. Two eight mil beads, Gemini pulley bead in between, size one swivel, and on the business end, small little bait, three o wide mouse, but that's the size of the bait. 
been experimenting a lot this year and I'm really not getting too many rays on the big baits but as soon as I downsize I seem to pick up the catch rate. I call this rig the 50-50 pulley but I'm not going to tell you why yet because I will do a, do a little video of how I make it uh, get you tuned into that one as well but yeah hopefully today it pulls out some rays thank you very much Come on, Mr. Raimondo! As you can see there, just the other side of my words, that's Shakespeare Cliff. I do have a lovely backdrop down here, and if I bring you around this way, about there, That's my house. Come round up. On a clear day you'd be able to see France out there. My work is directly behind me in the airport. Sky's, uh, sky's not looking too good, but I'm in my beach shelter. Ain't getting wet unless the fish decide to turn on, and uh, I'm out there in the rain all the time, which I don't mind if the fish are there. By well, the action on my right rod, there, that is swell. It confuses a lot of people when they see my rods going because obviously that one's braid, there's no give in it, so it feels absolutely everything. On the other rod, I've got mono, and as you can see, it's not moving at all. You just have to wait for that rod to just, uh, really hammer down, and you know you've got a fish on. But most people, you know, you, you can tell between bite wind, swell, wave crashing on it, should be able to. Well, at least the seagulls have uh, disappeared for now. They're starting to do me head in. I think six of them must have flown into my line. None of them tangled up, but Jesus, it makes you jump up thinking you got a good bite. My new hoodie from uh, North Sea Angling should turn up next week with the old Invicta. Kent flag on it. Represent the uh, North Sea Angling YouTube channel, which I'm very happy to be a part of. Well, I think I'm going to pack up. Uh, winds change east northeast. It is icy cold. Sea's got a bit rougher. I've had just that one dogfish. There's just no point fishing and throwing bait away. 
so I'll go home, reassess what I'm going to do, maybe get out tonight or tomorrow, depends on wind, wind direction. But I'll let everyone know and uh, till next time, stay safe. Happy fishing.